San Diego Padres owner Peter Seidler, who elevated his team to national prominence with financial commitments in the hundreds of millions but never saw the team win a World Series, died Tuesday. He was 63. The Padres did not disclose a cause of death, but Seidler, a two-time cancer survivor, revealed in a statement sept. 18 he had undergone a medical procedure the prior month that would prevent him from attending any games for the remainder of the 2023 season. Majority ownership of the Padres will remain in the Seidler family moving forward. The Padres will open the home plate gate at Petco Park on Tuesday afternoon for fans who wish to gather and pay their respects. The team will spend the rest of this week grieving his loss, but is expected to name its new field manager next week, likely before Thanksgiving. In a statement, Padres CEO Eric Groipner wrote, The Padres organization mourns the passing of our beloved chairman and owner. Peter Seidler, today, our love and prayers encircle Peter's family as they grieve the loss of an extraordinary husband, father, son, brother, uncle, and friend. Peter was a kind and generous man who was devoted to his wife, children, and extended family. He also consistently exhibited heartfelt compassion for others, especially those less fortunate. His impact on the city of San Diego and the baseball world will be felt for generations. His generous spirit is now firmly embedded in the fabric of the Padres, although he was our chairman and owner. Peter was, at his core a Padres fan, he will be dearly missed.